Hi everyone, thank you so much for your amazing comments and stuff. It's been really great to be able to go through all those messages. It's been, you've all been really lovely. This is the dress that I wore to my dad's funeral, which was a couple of days ago. It turned out to be quite a Luna Lovegood-esque outfit. I don't know if any of you saw my Twitter or Tumblr post about that. It was peculiar. I didn't even plan it, but I ended up wearing like sunflowers in my hair. Yellow, really yellow colours rather than black, because I think black would have been a bit too intense for me to handle alone, let alone anyone else. The funeral itself was great because it was really environmentally conscious. That's not something that you really give a lot of time to think about when you're in that space and you're, you're making all these difficult decisions decisions and all these very sad decisions. We found a company that helped us a lot with that. The casket itself was like this beautiful wicker casket and they didn't embalm him or anything. It was in this lovely wooded area and there was lots of light even though it was a rainy day. It smelled beautiful. So it was a really nice event as much as, you know, a funeral could be really. I've been keeping myself busy. My sleep schedule's a bit upside down. I don't really know what that's to do with probably just jet lag really. I've been colouring in. Christina started a new Tumblr, fyearcoloringbooks.tumblr.com, it's about the American way without the U because for some reason they have a vendetta against the use. I don't really understand why. And that was the first thing that I did. I coloured in Forks the Phoenix from this old colouring book. Uh, from Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets that I've had for years and years and years but I never actually coloured in. Another thing that I did is I went through some photographs and printed off some really nice photos from the last few weeks just to have some really nice new pictures up around my room. One of the ones I printed was actually my desktop background for a while which is um, lots of us at the ball at LeakyCon which you can't really see very well because I put this little frame on it. And I have this one which I really love of Hayley, me and Sammy. I turned it into a black and white picture but I found some photo paper and it worked out really well. These two were from the ball and then I think this was the first Wizard Rock Night and that was the second Wizard Rock Night. And this picture of me and my friend Brie which I really really loved as well was the other big picture that I printed off when I ran out of ink when I was trying to print this picture. But it's kind of hypnotising. Hayley wants to eat you! I've been reading a little bit and planning for lots of things that I need to plan. The admin side of things is the, probably <laughs> the hardest part of this whole experience, um, but there we go. I also started watching The Hours, which is this BBC drama, which is kind of trying to be like Mad Men in a way, um, in that kind of 1950s style. But it's great because it's a nice slow pace, but it's really exciting. It's got Romola Garay in it. It's really well done. It's all about the BBC newsroom. And it's great, and you should watch it, and I should find some other connectives. Goodbye.